37 people have gone missing in this house over a 14 year period. Okay, so I guess this is the front door. It's not locked. Hello? Who's down here? Oh my God. Hi guys, welcome to our channel. We are the Marshmallow Family. Welcome home. Before we get started guys, like, share, subscribe to our YouTube channel, smash that notification bell. We are going to give you three seconds to do that. Three, two, one, boom! I want to give you a big shout out to Life and Luxury for letting us react to one of their videos. Go and subscribe to their YouTube channel. Their link to their channel will be down in the description below. What's up, guys? Welcome back to a brand new episode of Luxury Dark. We've been away for a while, so to welcome us back, let's try to smash 100,000 likes in a on while. this video. They've not so done a video in months. They do a, a, a uh, video on Life and Luxury every month. Houses. Now, I don't really know why these houses, houses have to be sold on the dark web and not on normal real estate sites, but tonight we're going to try to find that out. All right, let's sit down and uh, check out the site. Okay, let's see uh, what's selling on this site. Okay, so these are the houses selling on here. Uh, most of them look kind of strange. Why don't you think these houses can just be like sold normally? Bro, there's something probably really cool about these houses so they can't sell them on the regular market. Okay, so reading through the names of these houses, we have Mr. Jeffrey's house, the Squeaky Needle, Margaret's house, the Rat's Nest, Uncle Perry's Cheesy Paradise. All them houses look so Playback. creepy. See, I don't even think I'll sold, actually buy one from the dark web, to be honest. Houses. Now I know yeah, it's actually obviously real. Obviously, these houses have special wow. features other ones don't have. Bro, what kind of features would you want to see in the Rat's Nest? Dude, let's just check out that first house, Mr. Jeffrey's. It looks really nice. All right. Okay, it says here that Mr. Jeffrey's house was built in 1879. There's seven bedrooms, three bathrooms, 5,400 square feet. Dude, that's huge. We should live here. Dude, you just saw one picture of it. Dude, it's a big house. We're gonna have so much room to do things. Okay, well, let's check out more pictures of this place. Oh, dude, come on, bro. This place does not look good. Why dude, look at that room. We could have bunk beds in that room. Why do you want to put bunk beds in that room? Dude, so it's like we're back at camp again. I never went to camp with you. What are you That's talking about? No, it'll, it'll, be, it'll be really okay, fun. Let's just, can we just read about this place? I don't know what you're talking about. Okay, so reading the description here, it says that 37 people have gone missing in this house over a 14-year period. The house was owned by Mr. Jeffries. It was deemed unfit for human habituation after police found trap doors and a series of tunnels in the walls with access to the guest bedrooms. Police attempted to question Mr. Jeffries. Look at the history it's got with it, look. Dude, that sounds messed what? up. Yo, I wouldn't even buy that house. That house is so too. creepy and tall, isn't it? Oh, something looks and really dark. about this man. Look and at the history on it. seems pretty dangerous, bro. How do you think he was never caught? Dude, he probably just retired. Retired from what? 37 people is a lot of people. You can't judge by that. He probably kept the house looking so good inside. Bro, we can already see what the house looks like. It already looks like trash. I promise I'm going to clean up all the trash once we get there, okay? Bro, you don't even clean up the trash here. Okay, you know what? I'll buy it, but you have to buy it right now and I'll pay you back. That's obviously just me buying it with extra steps. Dude, I promise you, this place is going to be an investment. You know this place is going to be so much fun. <sighs> okay. I mean, I'm buying this in the hopes that we can actually clean this place up and make some money back, all right? All right, let's do it. Okay, let's check this out. Okay, guys, so we just bought this house. I guess in a couple of hours, I'm supposed to get an email with the address, so I guess we can finally see where this place is. Dude, don't worry about it. I'm gonna bring the mattress, and we're definitely gonna sleep there tonight. Oh, dude, not the mattress. Dude, my grandmother gave me that mattress. It's been in the family for like 100 years. That's gross, and I'm not sleeping on that, and I'm not sleeping in the same mattress as you. Well, let's just wait to get the email to go check this place out, okay? Okay.
Okay, guys, so we're on our way to Mr. Jeffrey's house right now. Dude, it's our house now. They emailed you the deed, right? Hey, okay, well, I guess it is our house now. We've been driving for about five hours, so I really hope this place is nice enough to sleep in. We checked nearby. There's, like, no hotels nearby. This place is, like, in the middle of nowhere. It's going to be fine, bro. Remember, I strapped the mattress on top. Dude, I'm not sleeping on that mattress with you. Okay, fine. Sleep on the floor. Okay, we'll update you guys once we're there. Calls. Dude, this is it. This is it. This is it. Dude, this place looks amazing. This place looks awful, bro. Look how huge it looks. That Dude, house no is so haunted. Why would you want to live in this neighborhood? All right, dude, let's just get ready to move in. Okay, let's let's just go see what this place is like. Oh my god! Wow. No way. Okay, so uh, this is the place. Dude, this place is awesome. Bro, I don't know why you think this place is so sweet. It, it looks kind of run down. What do you mean? Yo, dude, look at this. Look at that. Dude, we'll fix this place up. It's going to be uh, cool. Dude, look at this. There's no window. Look at it. Dude, it looks creepy from the, the outside. Anyway? Why the would you even go you in? I use a window every day. Dude, we're going to be living here now. We, we have to get used to it. We even brought the mattress. Oh, dude, come on, bro. One mattress. Okay, so I guess this is the front door. It's not locked. It's uh, not good. Uh, bro. Bro, we'll fix this place up. I oh, promise. wow. Dude, the insulation is coming out of the walls. All right, let's just let's just go up those stairs there. Let, let's go see where our bedrooms are. Okay. I call the big one. Okay, let's go. There's a door. Dude, look at this. Come on. Bro. Oh, they put a window in it? There's no window. It's empty. Okay, open up. What is that? What's bro? going on? There's a bathtub in the middle of the that hall. That place bro. is probably haunted, oh or someone's still this living in that house and it's gonna come out. So much on this. Dude, this place is huge. It's awesome. It's not awesome, it's like, bro. There's no we windows don't anywhere the in the money. house. We could each have like three bedrooms. Do you think someone's been living in here, dude? There's like a can or something, or there's like a. Right, Someone's got be still living rooms. in that house. Okay, hold on. There's food and bottles and everything still in there. What? So I think we're gonna love living here. I think Parker's really starting to warm up living in this place. Okay, so this is the bathroom. Eh, um, nasty. Oh God. I think I'll hold what? it for now. Hell no. What's that noise? Hello? My pets. Is it a pet about place or something? Um. Oh, here comes another scary basement. Hello? I hate basements. This is creepy. Is this a room here? My girls, we had my pets on the door. Now he's found something that says my girls on. It's weird. For some reason, whoever lived here has a lot of IDs of girls. Hello? Who's down here? Doors. What in the world is that? What's that? In the cage. What? They're humans or what? Oh my god. God. Oh my god. That is creepy. <laughs>
Yo, that paint is still wet. I think someone's in here. Chester? Chester! Yeah, dude, I just saw a homeless guy in the basement with a cage. What? Dude, there's homeless guys in the cage downstairs. And this is normal to you? Dude, you gotta be joking me right now. Obviously. No, dude, I wouldn't joke about that. Come down and check out yourself. Oh, my God. Dude, you had to be joking me right now. Dude, I'm not. Dude, are there seriously people down there? Or are you just messing with me? Dude, I'm not joking. There's people down there right now. Come on, let's, let me let me show you. There's, there's Dude. it's like homeless people. Why would it? What? He's in there. Oh, bro. Bro. Oh. Dude, these are just animal cages for like dogs or something, bro. Dude, I swear there so were two people in So when else is in the house to let there them out? There were two people in these cages. They could have Dude, got out of their crates on the roof. Something, bro. That doesn't make any sense. Why would they be in cages? Dude, he must have—he must have got the key and got out. Just, I, I mean, you know, I'm uncomfortable being in this house. So why are you gonna make up stories? I told you, I'm not making it up. Dude, I—I I don't know. I, I can't believe this right now. Let's just, let's just get out of the basement. It smells down here. All right, dude. This is what I want to show you. Okay, come in here. Watch the place. What is this? Your room? Wow, dude. dude. You got your own window in here. Can you take this seriously? Why are you acting like this? Dude, look at this. There's a box of IDs, bro. And look at this, bro. Waiting for look the jump scare, because all that videos are Why jump scares. Why are you not the paintings of the same person? And this paint was still wet when I touched it, bro. What? Yeah, someone's been in here. You think someone's still living here? But yes. we bought the place. It doesn't matter, bro. Someone could've came in, there's no windows. You think someone broke in? I don't think someone broke in. I think someone's been living here. There's all these drawings. There's a look at this bed. These are signs of human life. Was, so what should we do? I think we need to get out of here. I'm not comfortable staying here tonight. Are you? Okay, we, we can come back tomorrow on this later. Just not. Okay, let's go. Let's get out of here, bro. Seriously. Oh, these stairs don't even feel safe. Yo, what is it, dude? Look in your car. What? Oh my god, who's dude, that? that oh my what? god! Dude, go inside, go inside! Quick, go, quick! What's going on? What's going on? Dude, was, do you think that was the homeless guy from earlier? I don't know what you're talking about, homeless guys, bro. Someone broke into our car. Bro, what are we gonna do? He, if he's in their car, how are we gonna leave? Dude, I don't know. We cannot stay in this house. We need to go. Oh god. Parker? Parker. Oh my god, it's in the window. Run, run, run. Run, run. run Oh my god, he's behind you. Anything off the dark web. Oh my god. That's all we got for tonight, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Like, share, subscribe to our YouTube channel, smash that notification bell for more upcoming videos. And here is the four shout outs that you guys have been waiting for. One, two, three, and four. If you guys want to shout out, all you got to do is like, share, subscribe to our YouTube channel, follow us on Instagram, and you could be the next shout out. We love you guys. We'll mail you later.